Under there, that's where the CPU is. Everything is connected to these contacts, so if any of these contacts are busted, your computer won't work. So if we think of like a human body, the motherboard is like a skeleton, and the CPU is like the heart, and the GPU would be like the brain. There's a lot more effort in building a computer and understanding it than I initially expected. Definitely makes me appreciate it more. My name is Abhishek Mugandan. I'm 19 years old and I live in Mississauga, Ontario, Canada. I always really had like an affinity for computers, so I decided that I would go into computer hardware engineering. So I just wanted to see what they would do in like a typical pre-built PC. Honestly, I feel like mine is much more organized. Building CPUs and APUs, it's all math-based. I always enjoyed math, but I was not always a great math student. So I would understand these concepts, but I could never apply them correctly. I wasn't happy with my grades in grade eight. I knew that to become a hardware engineer, I need to bring my marks up. I had friends who were in Kumon, they were blazing fast. So I told my parents that I need to go to Kumon. Kumon boosted my self-esteem basically. Every time I saw a math question on a test, I would be like, oh, I know how to do this. How are you doing? My grade 12 year, I finished the program and it was probably one of my proudest achievements. All right, so let's do this with Nikita. Michelle, my Kumon instructor, said that she might be interested in hiring me to become an assistant. She would always encourage me. She would always help me whenever I needed help. And now I feel like I'm doing that for these students. Knowing how to do it is great, but knowing how to do it efficiently and fast is much better. Seeing their face when it clicks, I think was one of the most satisfying experiences. My family is from India. The summer after grade 11, we were planning on going to India. And when I got to India every day, I made it a point to finish my Kumon. And my grandpa, he would see me there working with like a smile on his face because he was so proud. My parents, they obviously still miss India, but they knew that if we wanted to do anything with their education, we needed to go somewhere else where it was more accessible. They decided to move to Canada. If it weren't for my parents, I doubt I'd be the person I am today. I want to keep doing engineering, but I feel like I'm getting more keen on teaching. Working at Kumon made me realize how much I actually love helping students. What I learned in engineering will help me teach these students. Every day, I look forward to going to work.